The word Microsoft is one that most people have heard several times over. In fact, unless you happen to be living on a deserted island or under a rock, you could not get by without hearing about Microsoft. As an operating system, everything went according to their plan. They provided operating systems for every new computer, making their household name one that became extremely popular throughout the industry. A computer experience for anyone usually meant that you would have to understand how a Microsoft product worked. In fact, computing could not be handled unless the computer had their operating system on your computer. Some may have considered that as a monopoly, while others looked at it as a positive thing for the technology at that time. As it stands currently, others have the opportunity to get into the fray, and they have done so. Yet Microsoft still remains at the centerpiece of everything computer related. One of the problems with someone having that much control over an industry is the fact that they can overcharge for a product and even go so far as to gouge the customer. I don't have any idea what the costs involved in producing these operating systems were or what they are today, but one thing I am pretty certain of and that is that they are making it back several times over. When we purchase a new computer we feel we are getting our money's worth and we get a shiny new operating system for free. But I have news for you. The cost has been included in the price of your equipment. The retail price has been increased to adjust for any software on your spanking new machine. Yes, our good friends at Microsoft have definitely paved the way for all sorts of possibilities on the internet. But maybe it is time to give someone or something other than viruses back to their customers.